Shenandoah outscored the Eagles 21-0 in the third quarter as the Bridgewater College football team fell 38-20 on Saturday night in Winchester. The Eagles were driving on their first possession but fumbled the snap on a fourth down try in Shenandoah territory. After Josh Brooks nearly intercepted a third down pass, BC got the ball back on their own fourth down stop, however. Bridgewater took the lead late in the first quarter as Malavai Barker forced it in from one yard out to get the Eagles on the board. Following a Shenandoah field goal to make it 6-3, Jason Monroe broke the kickoff return for 83 yards, setting up Barker's second TD of the game and a 13-3 BC lead. Bridgewater's Devontae Womack forced a fumble on the opening kickoff of the second half, but the Eagles quickly had a punt blocked after a three and out, and Shenandoah scored on the next play to take their first lead of the game, 17-13. After the Eagles missed a field goal, Shenandoah scored again on a jump ball to Justin Ayers in the end zone to make it 24-13. Shenandoah would make it a 21-0 third quarter as Devontae Dunn picked off a pass, and Dershawn Heyman's touchdown catch finished off the drive with one second left in the quarter, pushing SU's overall run to 28 unanswered points. Jay Scroggins quickly found a wide-open Greg Ward over the top in the fourth quarter to make it 31-20, and Isaac Evans then picked off a pass later in the period, but the Eagles couldn't get another drive going in the fourth quarter. I coach an improved football team tonight, but against Shenandoah, as well as they've been playing as hard as that quarterback was, we were going to have to take advantage of every opportunity. I think, hey, when, from an offensive point of view, you know, if we're sitting there fourth and one, you know, we can't be arguing with the official about being one inch short. You know, we got to get that thing. And I thought that was a critical phase there in the game. You know, well, that should have been 20 to three at the time. It didn't turn into that. Uh, then they went a quick 96, and even though we had the lead at the half, uh, it, we, we gave up just a little bit of momentum right there and there's no question uh, we had a bad snap on that punt you know right out of the gate in the second half uh, you know that, that was a critical point because now you're playing catch up okay against a team when you, they allow their defensive front just to unload and, and not be as concerned about with a ball control run game and you know, that put us in a bad situation we knew all, all and all, all along this wasn't going to be a team we wanted to play pitch and catch with and we really got in that situation in the fourth quarter.